Hello Libra, it's my lady from My Lady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of October 23rd through the 30th, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish and I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for a like, share, subscribing and setting up personal readings with me and let's get this show on the road, okay? What's going on with the Libra, 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 Libra love reading October, October, October 23rd through the 30th, October 23rd through the 30th, 2017. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Okay, Libra. Okay. All right, so it seems like somebody's making quite a few wise decisions this week, okay? Okay, so it seems like um, about somebody, if I feel like somebody wants you to make a sacrifice, and you, this is a big deal. Somebody wants you to give up something this week, and you, like, really got to think about this. All right, ugh. I don't know why pets just came up to me. So it seems like somebody wants you to give up something, but it's violating your personal space. So it's something that you really care about that somebody wants you to give up, but I guess that's a sacrifice. All right, let's see if it'll tell us what this sacrifice is. What is this sacrifice? What is this sacrifice for the Libra, Libra, Libra? October 23rd through the 30th, 2017. Mm. So it seems like somebody may want you to open your heart more. Mm, yeah, so uh, let's, let's clarify once because right now it just seems like somebody wants you to give up that hard shell, you know, give up that hard exterior and open up. But it seems like you're not willing to do that just yet. All right. Ooh. It seems like you're not ready to give up that, but it seems like if you don't, they're going to leave you. If you don't like stop being so hard all the time, this is mine. Don't go over here. Don't go over there. They might leave. Okay? Or you're going to leave before you open your heart. It could go either way. All right. Oh, geez. We got some secrets going on. You know, but I feel like since it's in this area, the secret is going on. I feel like they're about like past heartbreak and betrayal, you know, and I feel like you haven't told your partner all this stuff. And that's why you rather leave because you're not ready to tell them all that. You're not ready to tell them why you can't open your heart. Yeah. Okay. So this could be. Uh, dealing with the child's parent or this could be um, dealing with a relationship that you really really cared about in the past but they didn't care about you you know and this could also indicate that the person that you're dealing with really cares about you but you really don't care about them because you're not willing to make a sacrifice to open your heart okay Ooh. okay this is where it gets naughty because it seems like the person is trying to manipulate you to get you to open your heart. And that's why you feel like you got to make this decision. All right. So it's like here, you got to either open your heart to this person. They really do care about you. But now you're starting to really not like them and want to be free from them because they're starting to try to manipulate you. But if you just open up, they wouldn't be trying to do this. But then it's like that little thing in your head. Like if you're doing this right now. What are you going to do later on, you know? Oh, okay. So it seems like this person has been a little bit dishonest, but that's linked to this manipulation, which is linked to you not opening your heart. Okay. So it's like, maybe if you open your heart, but this is just like a maybe situation. If you open your heart, maybe they'll stop lying and maybe they'll stop, you know, uh, trying to manipulate you. Okay. What's going on with the Libra, Libra, Libra? Libra, love reading, Libra, love reading, October 23rd through the 30th. 
Libra love reading. October 23rd, the 30th, 2017. Libra, Libra, Libra. Like I said, I read these straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. All right. So it seems like somebody has some messages coming in. So somebody's going to come try to tell you what's going on. And it might be somebody you really need to listen to about, like, the whole situation of you thinking about leaving this person because they want you to open up. Okay, so it seems like you may be... Yep, this is you. So it seems like you may be trying to... Uh, you getting pissed off. I feel like you getting pissed off at this person for trying to manipulate you. And you getting pissed off about the person who's bringing you the message. Like, don't tell me what to do, but this is all because of hurt that you had from in the past. And now that I'm thinking about this, you've been lying also. I think you've been lying to your partner and they've been trying to manipulate you. But it's all because you don't want to open up your heart and let them know what's going on, what's happened, why you, why you won't open your heart, okay? Okay, so it seems like... Uh, you could, I'm not doing any signs, <laughs> but, um, yeah, you, you're dealing with somebody who's like off balance or this whole situation got you off balance. You know, I feel like part of you wants to open your heart, but you're still hurt by something that happened in, in the past. Okay. Excuse me. So let me read this out of the book. So first we got the page of staffs. Page of staffs. All right, the page of staffs is upright. It says a cup person, but sometimes egotistical. Um, someone may bring you important news. Listen to it, a truthful person. So, it's like mm, somebody that you really don't you care for them, but you really don't care for them. It's like they gonna let you know what you need to do in this situation. You listen to them because you know they know what they're talking about. And then you have the temperance card. Temperance. All right, and that's reversed. It says frustration and anger and failure to accomplish your goals. So it's like, I don't know. First, I'm feeling like your goal, goal was to remain in a neutral state without you like being with somebody but not letting your feelings out, you know, and now you mad and frustrated that somebody got you to the point where you're thinking about it. Okay. So now we have the Emperor card and that's reversed it and it says generosity and manipulation. So this person you could be the dealing with a Aries, but you know, it don't matter general. But this person is trying to manipulate you by doing the things that should be done for you to get you to get out of your head, but you won't you won't do it. You won't do it. You ain't gonna do it until you're ready to do it. Okay? Which is right, you know, but it's also like what really are you fighting? The fight is over. This is a new person. This is a new situation. You know, don't let negativity ruin your future. Alright, so last we got the Knight of Swords. It say people may fight over some issue. The fight may occur quickly and the real issue is lost. Sometimes indicate a young man who is, uh, may help in a situation. So this makes me feel like this whole issue um, issue with y'all arguing about all this little stuff, the manipulation. But in reality, you got to get rid of that um, hurt from the past. You know, you got to learn to open your heart, you know, get over this freedom situation where somebody left you or you left them this hurt in the past. If you get over that, you know, you're, be, you'll be free. You know, you, you won't just be free from this new person. Cause I feel like they, they're only trying to help you. You'll be free from your mental trap, but that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful week.